Even to this day, we continue to follow the music. We work with the most famous drummers in the world to make the sounds that they need so they can make music. My name is Paul Francis, and I'm a cymbal maker for the Avidus Zildjian Cymbal Company. Cymbal making has remained the same for almost 400 years. Zildjian cymbal goes back to 1623. We're part of this legacy of cymbal making, and it's really, really exciting that we're continuing this history. We make well over 600 models in different diameters. And it's much like if you're a carpenter, you don't have one tool, you have a toolbox full of tools. So as a drummer, the cymbals are part of your toolbox. Okay, you have uh, a big cymbal like this, it's called a ride cymbal, you keep time on it. These are hi-hats, and these are two cymbals that come together. Then you have uh, crash cymbals, and these all offer different sound colors. So the drummer can express himself in a non-verbal way within the context of a piece of music. Symbol making is a lot like being a blacksmith or a farrier. There's a lot of steps that go into making a symbol. And you know, it can take a couple days. We're gonna take that casting, we're gonna throw it in an oven, then we're gonna shape it, we're gonna hammer it, we're gonna shave it, we're gonna lathe it. it goes down to a symbol tester, he plays it. Sound quality, cosmetic quality, we look for it all. I've had the privilege to work with a lot of great drummers, Steve Gadd, Elvin Jones, Zach Starkey, who is actually Ringo Starr's son. Zach plays in The Who in a variety of other bands, and Carter Beaufort. Carter Beaufort plays with the Dave Matthews Band. The list goes on and on. I've been here for 30 years. It's really fantastic that I'm actually part of the world of music and music that's going to be created or has been created. And it's my job right now to make sure that, that my knowledge gets passed on to the next people that are gonna continue it for the next 400 years.